Today we are going to do a white light protection meditation. And the reason that we do white light protection, which honestly, it can be whatever color you want. Mine is usually a translucent color. Um, very rarely am I doing white light. But this is what I would suggest that you do before you go into any situation, especially if you are at all in any way feeling like you need that extra um for that extra boost or that extra layer of protection for your day. I would start the white light meditation as soon as you've grounded yourself before you roll out of bed in the morning. So what I will ask you to do once we get into the meditation is you get to pick a shape that is your favorite. For me, it is always an upside down triangle. You pick the color. Like I said, mine is translucent. And this is a shape that you will step into in your etheric spiritual body. And by being able to do this, you can carry it with you wherever you go. It can protect you while you're driving in the car. It can help you, you know, be protected in a classroom situation, on a phone call. Um, the protection is unlimited with this white light protection meditation. Just know that I would suggest that you ground yourself first and then go into this meditation and know that the white light will stay connected until you consciously choose to disconnect or step out of it. You have the ability to change the color depending on your mood and your mind's eye, whatever color feels more protecting for you in the moment, whether it's red or purple or white or translucent like I choose. Um, I wish you all the best of luck with your white light meditation and grounding. Okay, today we are going to start in a seated position, whatever is most comfortable for you. I would suggest crossing your legs, rolling your shoulders back and down a few times, and finding a comfortable position to allow your hands to fall into your lap in a receiving position, if that is most comfortable for you, palms up and open. I want you to begin to close your eyes down as you take a breath in and exhale. Take in another deep breath and exhale as you settle into your sits bones as you get comfortable in the seated position that you are now in. Another breath in and out. And we're going to start with grounding. I want you to see a tree root or a cord coming up out of the ground and attaching itself to your root chakra. And then I want you to watch this cord go down into the ground, through the dirt, the rocks, the water, all the way to the center of the earth where it will take the other open end and attach itself to the center of the earth. And you can look down in your mind's eye and see how securely you are attached to the earth. This is your grounding cord and it will remain attached until you consciously choose to unattach it. It can present in any color, whatever color resonates most with you in the moment. And now I want you to come back into your body with the grounding cord attached, knowing that this grounding cord exists for you to send back to the earth anything that is not serving you, anything that is not of your highest good, anything that can be transmuted and transformed and recycled and sent back out into the earth as positive energy to serve others. So go ahead and take a moment, take a big deep breath, breathe everything up, all the muck out of your toes and your ankles, breathe it up through your legs and your knees and your thighs into your hips and everything down from your head to your neck to your shoulders and your arms into a big ball at the root center and watch it go down through your grounding cord to the earth to be transmuted, transformed, recycled, and sent back out into the earth to serve as a positive light for someone else. And as you are sitting here, clearing yourself, I want you in your mind's eye 
to look out ahead of yourself and start to notice at a distance a shape, any shape. What is that shape? Does it even need a name? And you notice the shape out in front of you and it's getting closer to you and closer and as it gets closer you realize it has a color what color is that does it have a name and it's continuing to come closer and closer and you realize that you can reach out for it so I want you to reach your hand out and feel your shape and notice that your hand in fact can go into the shape and that the shape is big enough for you to step into it. I want you to take one step and two steps and notice that your grounding cord along with your whole humanly body has stepped into this shape. Whatever color it is, whatever shape it is, this is your protection. Take a big deep breath in, exhale on the exhale. If anything is still lingering in your body that no longer serves you, please send it down through your grounding cord. And notice that you are protected, divinely protected, in whatever color resonates most with you. This is your tool to take with you as you leave today to go do anything that requires your attention. This will protect you as you drive, as you go in and out of stores. It will protect you in conversation with others. This is your spiritual toolkit white light protection device. Take another big deep breath in. Exhale. One more breath in. And exhale. And I want you to start coming back into your body and into the room. Wiggle your toes and your fingers. Start to flutter your eyelids and become aware that you are in your room or wherever you have landed. Slowly open your eyes and go about your day knowing that you are completely grounded and protected.